Epicor Trucker here. Today I'm over right outside Detroit. I'm gonna try some Gus's fried chicken, world famous. Let's see how this goes. Just finished up eating my chicken from Gus's. Uh, went to the location in Westland, Michigan, which is right off uh, the 275, right outside Detroit. Never been to that location before. Eat at Gus's a bunch of times. Um, the location in Knoxville, Tennessee. Been there a few dozen times over the years and it was, never had a bad experience there. So, went out of my way a little ways to stop there and try that. And uh, I was not disappointed. It's like a little mom and pop kind of dive place. I'm um, pretty sure it's a, it's a franchise, um, but I mean, the place was good, the food service was good, they were friendly, um, the chicken was piping hot. I mean, it came right out, out of the fryers. I had to uh, let it cool down for about a good 15 minutes before I was able to eat it. So that's why there's no video of that. I had to hit the road trying to get back home. So I kind of picked at it while I was driving. It was definitely not a letdown. Chicken was good. Fire Libra what was to die for. I mean, I, I could just eat that all day, every day. Um, the potato salad was so so. Um, I, I'm really picking my potato salad. Um, I've had it a few times at the one in, in Knoxville, and this one tasted just about the same. I just wanted to order it and see what it, you know, how it was any different. I mean, it's almost identical to the one they serve. Knoxville so I mean I know everybody else that ate there with me they love their potato salad I just it just doesn't do it for me but there is nothing wrong with it it's just my personal taste um, but the chicken the fried okra I mean you can't go wrong I've never had a bad meal from Gus's fried chicken yet but I'm gonna start exploring more and, and trying different locations I'll hit up another one next time I go towards Detroit. I'll probably uh, check out the Alabama one later on this year when I head back down there. But yeah, Gus's fried chicken. As always, I gotta I gotta give it. I'll give it nine out of ten. No, solid nine out of ten. And if there is a some of the seasoning was in like proportion with some of the chicken but it's it's no big deal but salt nine out of ten I mean there, there's very little that we can do to make it any better usually the one in Knoxville is, is about a ten, 10 out of 10 about 80% of the time and the rest of the time it's like an eight and a half nine out of ten just, you know, quality control. You, they can't hit it, you know, on the head every every single time. So, I'm not gonna, you know, really take much away from that. But I would definitely stop at that one again. If I'm in the area, I would definitely stop there and eat again. If you're in the Detroit area, there's pick three locations. I'd, uh, I'd give them a shot, try them out. Just heads up, it's, it's gonna be a little spicy. Um, and then I give you hot sauce on the side if you want to, if you want even more spicy, which I'll partake sometimes in the hot sauce, but usually it's it's hot enough just just the way it comes. Yeah, now I'll wrap up this video. 